Hey, Lene? What is this place? And what's this rock I'm suddenly holding? How should I know, you idiot? Why don't you wipe that stupid look off your face and start examining your surroundings? Well, she's mean. I know I've come across her before, but my god, you are one mean bitch. You never know when an enemy could strike. Never know when an enemy could strike. Yeah, I know. You don't have to be so mean. Yeah, why have to be so mean? She's right, boy. If you get defeated here, that stupid face of yours is going straight into a coffin. Really, old man? Can you leave my face out of this? Fine. You want me to look serious? I'll look serious. But well, you're already looking serious. Hi. Please don't tell me you're serious about looking serious. Why, why are you all bullying Hyde? What? Why do you sound so disappointed? What's wrong with my serious look? Hello, what this? This is Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battle. It is a beat em up, uh, but features like Persona, Ruby, uh, Blaze Blue, and this story arc, which is one that I've never heard of before. Um, in birth, something or other. It's like visual novel, beat em up kind of thing going on. How are you? <laughs> Worry not. The measure of a man is not in his appearance. Not in his appearance? Dude, you're the one who's like a freaking tree stood in the background. It still sounds like I have a face problem. Yeah, you do, Hyde. I like his hair, though. Even if you do, a man's worth is not decided by his face, but the size of his heart. I was hoping she'd say something like heart instead of something else. Dirty bitch. Thank you. See, this is how you calm someone. Wait, who was that? I heard the voice, but I don't see anyone. How is the real life waifu then from? Hmm. It takes skill to get so close to us undetected. This may be a worthy opponent. Maybe a worthy opponent. And don't worry, I didn't have any nightmares from last night with your boy, anime boy look and weird shit. Stop, stop! I don't want to fight! Please put away those scary claws of yours. I do what, sees? My keyboard is loud. I was just saying, I didn't, um, I was like, how is the anime waifu today? Don't worry, I didn't have any nightmares uh, of your anime boy look yesterday. <sighs> Lol. <laughs> Not only is she formless, I can't even sense her presence. Who the hell are you? Who the hell are you, bitch? Huh, that's a little complicated. I guess you could call me the moderator? She seems harmless enough. Okay, moderator. Why don't you tell us what's going on here? What's going on here? Hey, Lene, are you sure we can trust her? Aren't you just telling me to be careful? I am being careful. I'll decide whether or not I can trust her after I hear her explanation. Lene, you're just a badass sassy bitch. Right now, getting information out of her is all we can do. Hey! You two, stop whispering to each other. I have an important announcement to make. She's already pissing me off. Damn. Well, I guess we really don't have any other choice. No, you don't. By the sounds of it. Okay, now that you have all piped down, let me try the title call one more time. Welcome to the 37th Keystone Scramble Tag Battle Tournament! Let the games begin! Ooh! Huh? Yeah, I know. It's all a little much. But don't worry, I'm feeling generous. So I'll give you a rundown of the rules. Oh, thank you. Since all of you come from the same world, you'll be a team. Your job is to protect the Keystone. If you can do that, you can go back to your original world, to Kanzakai. I didn't even know that was the actual world, but well, fair play. However, 
If anyone takes this away from you, you won't be able to return to Kanzakai. I know it's harsh, but them's the rules. That, well, that actually kind of could pull off being your voice there with a bit of a voice modulator. You know, like a fucking voice mod on like Stream Deck or something. All right. I wish you all long, happy, and lucky lives. Like proper sass as well. That's it? Yep, that's the whole briefing. You can take it from here. Good no luck. more front! Exterminate. What? Wait a minute! You call that a briefing? You didn't explain Jack! Done talking, huh? Is that seriously all the explanation we get? I'm just so glad it's fully voice acted this, so I don't have to read everything. You tell us only what you want to, then disappear, huh? What about that stone you showed me earlier, Hyde? The one you found yourself holding all of a sudden? You mean this? Oh, it's a purple one this time! I'm going to assume that that's the keystone she was referring to. And with the limited information we have, we have no choice but to keep it safe. Keep it safe like a baby. Ah, clever. We merely need to defeat whatever enemies assail us. Hold that treasure close, boy. To be fair, from though, when you were saying, Ooh, what's this? You're lucky it's not uh, Bikini Babes and Super Soakers. I was thinking about playing some of that today. Still might do in a bit, depending on what I feel like doing. Oh, come on, old man. Wouldn't it be safer for you to hold it? Why, just because it's big? Loath as I am to admit it, I tend to get distracted in battle. Should I step on the stone and shatter it, we're all doomed. Well, Ned, that's... I keep thinking that's Torbjorn. Yeah, I've never known you to be terribly delicate. <laughs> Indeed. And the stone is such a tiny thing. I wouldn't trust myself to carry it. And that, I keep thinking that sounds like Torbjorn's voice actor. Torbjorn's big brother, Torbjorn! Fair point. But are you sure I'm the better alternative? If I lose this thing, we have to say goodbye to our ticket home, right? Don't worry so much. If you've been able to keep the insulator safe, you can handle the stone. Oh, what a name for a sword. The insulator. <laughs> Fuck that series, that shit. Insulator. My, you're awfully close. I'm a little jealous. Oh, it's that rabbit bird again. Another voice? Who's there? It's always there. Creepy bitch. Oh, did I interrupt? I'd apologize, but I don't know you well enough to care. What the? She came out of a hole in space. Lost in space! It appears the voice wasn't lying earlier. I didn't expect our first opponent to be some little girl, though. And don't forget, she's got Broly. Do not let your guard down. She may appear to be a child, but her overflowing energy is that of a monster. Tell us, creature, who are you? Creature? Oof. Oof. Hey! You've all been awfully rude to the princess. Did that toy just speak? Where are toys? Quiet down, Guy. Or do you want to be punished again? It's like one of them freaking baby lolly dominatrixes or some shit. Ah! I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm afraid I haven't introduced myself. My name is Rachel Alacard. I've no interest in your names, so don't bother returning the introduction. What a snobby bitch! Instead, allow me to ask you a favor. Hey, CJ, how's it going, dude? A uh, favor? Indeed. It pertains to the keystone you're holding. Give it to me. No. That's more of a command than a favor. Sorry, but you're barking up the wrong tree. If you want the stone, then you better be ready to take it from us. How stubborn. Well, this is troubling. 
Whatever should I do? Right, before I carry on, I've got this weird feeling it's going to be the Master Yi crossover Genji crossover Super Saiyan looking dude that's her partner. If it isn't, I will be surprised. You there. What would you do in my situation? Stop hiding and tell me, would you? Oh shit, man, not be. Impressive. Oh, it isn't. You saw right through me. Damn, it's a Persona character. Where? Shit. I had hoped to hide my presence completely, but it seems my best efforts fell short. Damn it, I've been fucking stumped. What? Another ambush? <laughs> What a lovely day this is turning out to be! Ambush? Oh, not at all. I'm just a detective. I'm just a detective with a very suspect voice. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Naoto Shirogane. Charmed. So what are you doing here, detective? Investigation, of course. And stop pointing that gun in my face! Huh? Investigation? You're telling me you're not curious? About the inner workings of this world? About the reason we were all brought here? I, for one, want to answer those questions. This detective seems a little odd. Just a bit. <sighs> anyway, I'm looking for information. If you don't mind, I have a few questions. Okay, okay, break it up. Stop right there. I do love that voice of a woman. Uh, oh no, shock. The, the voice. Anime as fuck. Investigation. Looking for information. Give that boring stuff a rest. We've got all these people hanging around in one place. Why waste time thinking when you could be tag battling? Now hurry up and split into teams. Tag battling, uh, that's what the kids call it nowadays, you know. <laughs> What's with her? She comes out of nowhere and starts directing things all of a sudden? I, I, I tag that, you know what I'm saying? I see, so this is what she meant by moderator. What a joke. What a joke. No questions allowed, huh? The world itself is trying to keep us from sharing information. It must be hiding something. Hey, shut up! Zip it! You know what? That's it! You're fighting now! Boom! <laughs> There's contestant one. Boom! My drop. Uh, no room for negotiation, it seems. Oh, how convenient. Very well. I shall be this detective's partner. Wow, you're quick on the draw. Doesn't sound like you need any coaxing. Wait, are they seriously getting ready for battle? Oh, they are, mate. They are. Good. What a fine idea this is. He is. I can hardly suppress my thirst for battle. You can hardly suppress your muscles. I don't even know what I call that, whether that's a 47 pack. Muscle upon muscle? Ruby Kid 42, how are you doing, dude? At least someone's excited. Come, child. This is a wonderful opportunity to show you how to handle yourself on the battlefield. It's like muscle upon muscle upon muscle. What? You're dragging me into this? Yes, we are, Hyde. Are you two ready? Then I am happy to announce the kickoff of our first battle. Here we go! Now, I wish, and, and this is the sad thing from the last two episodes I've done, I just wish that, um, Get ready. that that was a, a difficulty level, because it seems the story fights are, like, really, really easy and cheesy. He's got, like, freaking packs on packs. Why you? Why you? <laughs> Slash. <laughs> <laughs> I've never played as a sky before. I kind of feel like he's got like mahoosive arms in my opinion. I just got hit by a frog. Fucking what the fuck, bro? 
Oh, I need to learn the fucking moves for this guy. There we go. I'm getting yeeted! I was getting yeeted! So, this is the power of another world. Yeah, if it could be a smidgen like, you know, another difficulty level, that'd be great. I seem to walk through these. They were far more dangerous than I'd predicted. We should withdraw and heal our wounds. I'm not really keen on that big guy. His arm's like too massive for the game, in my opinion. What's wrong? Is that all you got? That all you got? That stone. Be sure to take good care of it. They've escaped. Still, they were very skilled opponents. My blood hasn't burned like that in quite some time. Oh, well. So what's someone getting up to for this Friday then, guys? What's cracking? What's going down? Any plans for the weekend? Feel free to share. Hyde, are you okay? Do I look okay? Yeah, pretty much. But their powers... They were like... So OP. Like in-births. But if they were really in-births, I would have been able to tell. For what it's worth... I could not sense that they had any exist powers. So if they're like in-births, but not in-births, what are they? Clearly not in-births. <laughs> and I sense a darkness here. Improvising. And it's not the Hollow Knight. Waldstein and I will chase after them. The information they hold is too valuable to simply let them slip away. In the meantime, I want you to learn all you can about this world. So you're gonna leave by right, hold on. I'm in a world where I don't know what's going on. I've got a freaking stone I've got to protect. Then the big ass bodyguard and the little sassy ass bitch decide, you know what? You're on your own. We're going off for a bit. See you later. Um, Roger. That's some smart plot thinking right there. But don't push yourself too hard. Sucks to suck. And not just for the sake of protecting the keystone. Don't give me that shit one. Get back to Kanzakai together. Alive. I don't suck. Me too. Count on you too, old man. Ha! I will claim the head of the mastermind behind all this before you know it. Well met. I don't I can't do that voice. No that well one. met. Find us a way home. Okay, so that's chapter one done. Right. Better get investigating. So, where do I start? Yeah. I should try to find somebody to talk to about all this. Just gotta look for people. Well, that means using social skills. That didn't sound good. Oh. That was fast. <laughs> oh, dear. Ow, ow, ow! Damn it! Didn't think that'd happen! Yusuke! Hey, Panamora, you okay? I told you to stop! <laughs> I still need to play Persona 4 properly. I played Arena, but not Persona 4. Yeah, but, I mean, come on! A bike would make our search so much easier! You really thought you'd be able to just bike around a crazy world like this? It's way too dangerous! Of course you were gonna crash! Social skills? I know. None of us have any. It's terrible. <laughs> Who are you sat on? Please tell me it's Ruby. Are you sat on Ruby? Well, you've got a point. Everything keeps changing. Common sense just doesn't seem to apply. I guess I should have tried the bike in the first place. That's what I'm saying! Now come on, get up already! Yeah, get up already! <laughs> yeah, that sounds like Ruby. By the way, do you hear a voice or something? Huh? 
A voice? I hear voices. Yeah, now that you mention it, I do. Whoa, Hanamura, beneath you! There's somebody there! Yeah, you sat on her. Whoa! I, I, I'm so sorry. I didn't... Ah! Oh, I thought I was gonna die. Now I'm even here, I'm thinking Paimon, I don't know why. Are you okay? You're not hurt, are you? My, my bad. I guess you got caught up in my bike accident, huh? Just a tad. Well, because of that massive ass scythe thing. Oh, oh, my head feels so funny. Hey, what the hell's going on here? The fuck? Whoa, well, who, who are you? Your worst nightmare. Oh, are you her friend by any chance? Seriously, what's your deal? Is bullying this poor girl that much fun to you? I'd become the White Knight. Huh? No, 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 no. It's not what it looks like. Yeah, I mean, yeah it is kind of my fault. But, but Tell it's me, are you think. going literally all in bar in one? Just for shits and giggles. You think I care about your justifications? Just get away from her. Just get away from if her. If you don't, come forth, insulator. Is he summoning a persona? Oh, I guess not. No, it's a big red dildo. Ah, wait, j j just, just listen for a second. That's so cool! <laughs> I love her. Huh? What? What is that? That's huh? amazing! Did you make it yourself? What the hell do? Huh? Name? Well, it's Insulator, I guess, but... That's awesome! But where did it come from just now? From my pants! Actually, wait, don't tell me. Oh, uh, you didn't have it out a minute ago, so it's gotta be... Oh, nope, <laughs> can't figure it out. I give up. I have no idea. From his pains, I told you. You've got to tell me more about it, though. Uh, more about it. It's long, hard, red and shiny. What do you make it out of? Does it transform? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Just... Does it transform? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's a sword. I don't know what it's made of, and I don't think it transforms. Oh dear. You're driving me nuts. Oh, poor Ruby. And where does it come from? My hand? Wait, does it come from my hand? Then where does it go? God, dang it! You're starting to infect my brain. <laughs> come on, tell me more. Tell me more. Hey, that girl really seemed to bounce back as soon as she saw that sword. She's got a fetish for weapons. <laughs> I'll say. Looks like she's okay. I mean, summoning a sword from your body sounds super cool. You're like a character from some fairy tale. Or oh, an anime. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> What's your name, anyway? Oh, me? I'm Hyde Keto. Just call me Hyde. Hyde, got it. And what about you guys? Wait, us? Well, I'm Chie Satanaka, and this is Yosuke Hanamura. The intellect level of that conversation. I know, innit? This is what I'm saying. Social skills, bro. Social skills. Yeah, nice to meet you. Or uh, to have met I love you. anime conversations. I really do. Some of it is so like, wow, okay. Wait, what are we doing exchanging friendly introductions? Are you okay? Huh? Me? Why? Well, wasn't there an attack? Hmm? On who? You! Wow, she's so dancy. By whom? <laughs> Those two! What? <laughs> <laughs> huh? Huh? The fuck? He told you it was all a misunderstanding. I uh, kind of fell off my bike and onto her. 
Yeah, it really surprised me. Uh, by the time I realized what was going on, I was squished underneath him. <laughs> Squishy. Ooh, ooh. God, I'm really sorry about that. Seriously. Ruby, you adorable bean. I know, isn't she? She's proper adorable. <clears throat> so, uh... My brain! What, what are you hearing about, uh, CJ? What's up? Are you confused as much as everyone else is? Sorry, I guess. Ooh, ooh. Oh, please, there's no need to apologize, but thanks. I mean, no harm, no foul, right? <laughs> Says the guy who ran over some poor girl. Maybe I should just keep my mouth shut. Yeah, I think you might have to do it. Just, just, just a smidge. Just a, just a smidge. Uh huh? Sorry to butt in, but this isn't like a fun after-school cafe meetup or something. If you could just hurry up and start fighting, I'd appreciate it. I'd appreciate it. I mean, I'm trying to run a tournament here, and the friendly chat isn't exactly scooting things along. You again? Do we have to? They don't seem like bad people. Aren't you so, like, full of joy and happiness? Psst. Just between us, that guy with the brown hair and the girl with him have some pretty interesting weapons. And it's time for a battle! <laughs> I'm all in! You've got me at weapons! That voice just threw oil onto a fire! And you're my partner, Hyde! Oh, lovely! Sure. She's really insistent. Uh, why do things always have to end in a fight? It's the anime way. Oh, looks like we got one tag team ready and ready to go. See, that's the way you kids ought to act. What? Why are you so excited about this? Seriously, we were so close to getting out of this conversation peacefully. Mm, you think so? Doesn't look like we've got much chance to run. Our timing will have to be perfect. Hey, stop your complaining. Besides, it's the way of the weave. The, this close to the ready, way of the weave. You'll receive a penalty. If the moderator says so, I guess we're out of luck. Let's just get this done quick. Okay, let's go. Right, I'm gonna use uh Get ready. Get I'm gonna ready. use Ruby first. Because I kinda know how to play as her, because she was one of the first characters I warmed up with when I first played this. Can't escape from crossing fate. Fight! Yeah. Oh fuck you! I'm it. Too easy. I won't give up. I, I need even better difficulty level. Oh my god. Oh, that's why I like Ruby. What the hell is going? Wow! God damn it, Satanaka! Now! Jesus, that is the most I've had. Christ! I'm really sorry about that, guys. That is like the most I've had come through. I apologise if someone didn't get taken out. Uh, oh, I know, I know. It's just annoying. That My bad, guys. <laughs> yeah, I'm just saying it. <laughs> Dude, just got a hell of a multi Nice, nice. Roger, retreat, retreat! I was like, oh my god, all this chat interaction. Thoughts. Shit. No, wait! What was that crazy thing you had fighting next to you? 
Was it a big doll or something? I want to see. No, you don't want to see my sex doll. Wait, Ruby? Where are you going? Don't leave me, Ruby. Hey! And away she goes. Wow, what an energetic young lady. Just a smidge. And you forced me into yet another battle. What are you up to anyway? Me? <laughs> like I said earlier, I'm only up to moderating. Trust I killed Sackular. I've been playing Doom. Oh, is it Doom or Unreal Tom that's I killed? No, that's um, Halo when it killed Sackular. I could be wrong. Oh, sure you are. Mark my words, I'm going to figure you out eventually. Double kill. Triple kill. Guess I'm on my own again. Excuse me. But I'm starting to see how the gears are turning here. We're not the Halo, only yeah, ones yeah. who were dragged here from another world. I played Halo in ages. Like everybody's from somewhere else. But the only way back is this damn keystone. And everyone here is ready to fight for it. Oh, they are so ready to fight for it. It's pretty complicated for such a sick joke. I just gotta make sure I don't let my guard down. Speaking of which... Stop hiding! Oh no! Oh, hello! I didn't think you'd notice me. This is a badass with... What is that? Is that a gun blade or some shit? Like gun with a like weird knife attachment thing. The fuck is that? You were pretty high up there. You must be really agile. Oh, 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 she must be. Ugh. I take it you're after the keystone? <sighs> Giving me the silent treatment, huh? Well, unfortunately for you, I'm not ready to give this up. So, you got pulled into this world too? And you want to go home? Am I right? It's a cleaver katana gun. <laughs> what do I. What is that weapon? It's a cleaver katana boomerang. <laughs> yes, that's right. Then please, just listen to me. I don't think that following the rules to a T is our answer here. Oh, she's a Ruby character, isn't she? I don't remember. I'm assuming she's a later character, because I don't remember her. I've seen some of the Ruby shows. Only the people with the keystones Unless I'm to go mistaken. Home, that means everyone else gets left behind. I know I've seen the early series, anyway. That's too cruel. There has to be a way for everybody to get back to where they're from. Until I figure that out, until I understand everything, I need to be really careful with how I handle this thing. Does that make sense? Totally. I get what you're trying to say, but we need to get back to our world as soon as possible. She's Blake Bell Donna from Team Ruby. So she is from Ruby. I'm trying to picture them. I've, I've seen Ruby on, um, I've seen the show, but I've only seen like... I'm not like your group i've only There's seen no so many I of them can place my trust in someone i just met i just don't know if it's like later series stuff unless i just can't picture him yet not like us that's right so if you're telling me that you can't give me your keystone then you're giving me no choice but to take it oh, that's gonna be tough one there's only two of us and we need four people <sighs> damn it why does it always end up like this Huh? Who's there? This is really not what I need right now. Oh, it's the you squirrel girl! Me. I was gonna snag the keystone while you were distracted. Boobies! Oh, that was close. Can't let my guard down at all in this world. So you're here to take this thing too. Huh? Nice, oh well. Yeah, pretty much. It'd be better if I didn't have to beat you up first, but uh, that's not happening, huh? 
Nope. I was just explaining that to this girl when you... Hmm? Is something wrong? Those ears and that tail. Are you a Faunus? Oh, a Wawa? Uh, what? A what now? A Faunus? What's that? She's a squirrel. <sighs> Don't worry about it. I'm Makoto. Makoto Nanaya. Even though I've never heard the word Faunus before, I'm going to guess that it's similar to what we call a demi human. Which would make you a bonus, huh? Uh, that's right. You can tell? Um, well, she doesn't have any, like, bushy tail or shit. Well, yeah. I work in the NOL's intelligence division. A ribbon isn't enough to hide those ears from me. But I imagine they put you through hell in your world, too. Yeah, I know how that feels. You're right. Aw, uh, there's no need to look so sad. It's part of what makes us special. What, having weird animal ears, cat ears and stuff? This is going deep, this. <laughs> special? That's right. For example, I love nuts. <laughs> I'm nuts about them. That's part of what makes me me, you know? <laughs> I wish the sound effects would work, so I have to reinstall bloody Stream Deck and look, I can't... Not. Oh, it's working now! Not. Yes, it's working! He's obsessed with nuts. God, everything's break. I apologise, everything's breaking or been breaking, and everything's just kind of all gone weird recently, I'm sorry. It's like when you get a chestnut parfait, the sweetness of the parfait combines with the nuttiness of the chestnuts to make something super amazing! What the fuck's a parfait? Do you get it now? Sounds posh. Oh, that reminds me. I didn't catch your name. It's Blake. Okay, Blake. What kind of food do you like? I like, um, seafood, I guess. <laughs> um, I'll tell you what, right? This is the third episode out of four from the first line of story, right? And some of the conversations and stuff in this game it is borderline, like, what the fuck character building, just saying. So, uh... Seafood? Wow! Someone's got some elegant tastes. Really? I don't know about elegant, I just like fish. Oh! <laughs> um, I'm really glad you guys are bonding over your favorite foods and stuff, but... Are we gonna actually fight or something? Need one more character? I've already drawn my sword and everything. Need one more character? Oh, right. Sorry. Got kind of carried away there. <clears throat> now, hand over the keystone. Well, you'll get punched in the face. You do look pretty strong. Uh, hey, Blake, can I ask you a favor, girl to girl? Wow. Girls ganging up on me. What is it? Can you help me take that dude's keystone? Sure. With pleasure. Wow, I could have asked you. Wow, oh, somehow I knew this would happen. Wait, don't I need a tag partner too? <laughs> Looks like you're in a pinch, kid. Oh, is it the other guy with like the god knows what size pack? Yeah. You. Yeah. Here I am, wandering around, and then I stumble onto this fun little scene. Guess my luck ain't so bad after all. That's a six-pack and a half, that. Get it? Eat something. <laughs> Get some meat on your bones, kid. Amnesia. Didn't think you guys would be here, too. How long has it been since that night? My boss really put you through hell, huh? I never wanted to see your goddamn face again. Oh, lighten up, kid. I'm just trying to extend a helping hand here. Enemies come together to fight a group of girls. Oh, I'll tell you where you can put your hand. 
You can make nice all you want, Ooh. but I know you're after something. I was waiting for that to stop there. I can tell you where you want to put your hand. In my ass. Perish the thought. Didn't mean to eavesdrop or anything, but it sounds a bit like you need a partner in order to fight these young ladies. Are you telling me you want to team up? Doesn't exactly look like you got much choice, does it? No, well, that's true. Wow, what a development. Are these the gentle stirrings of a blossoming tag team I see? What? Hold on a second. I'm not gonna tag with- Stop quibbling about bygones. They're called bygones for a reason, aren't they? Come on! Bam man! Oh, come on, Bam man! You're sounding more and more manly the more you talk, yeah. Jesus. How does this have anything to do with being a man? Be a man! Be a man! Give it up, kid. Just let me take part in your fun little event here. Of course, that's all you care about. <sighs> Fine. But I've got some words for you once we're done with this. Are you ready yet? I'm getting bored here. All right. Let's take him down, Blake. Blake. Look at that. We're really upping the voltage on this one. Now, let the battle begin. All right. Let's take him down, kid. Don't just copy what she said. <sighs> Fine, who cares? Let's just do this. Let's just do this thing. Get ready. Um. Pull them too. Let's go. Ow, to be put with a cute squirrel kill. <laughs> oh my god damn it. Right. Can't escape from crossing fate. Fight! I still love the music for this game as well. It's freaking awesome. Not yet. Oh, they just got slapped. Is that all? We haven't lost Damn it! Okay. Alright, alright. She sat on my face! She sat on my face! I got this! Hot slice! Take this! One, two, three! Take split first! One, two! Get your finish! Easy! Easy! Come on, give me a challenge! Ugh. We need to rethink our strategy. Yeah, you do. Aww! Hey, Blake! Wait for me! Sheesh! Those girls were crazy. Who else this match? <laughs> I thought they were fun. You're seriously the last person I would have expected to see here. I don't even know how it happened. I was just here. At first, I thought it was the power of the night at work. But that doesn't seem to be the case. So, I started wandering in search of a familiar face. And after a while, I found you. Oh, familiar face, your enemy. I see. Hey, what have you learned about this world so far? According to the voice overseeing all of this, some weird rock is supposed to be the key back to our world. If I protect it until the end, I get to go back. That's pretty much all I know. Pretty much the same as me, then. But... But... If she really wanted us to fight over the keystone, should just have us kill each other until there's only one of us left. But that's not what she does. Once a battle is over, she doesn't lock up the loser or anything. She lets everybody go. 
Sounds to me like she's got an ulterior motive. Oh, she definitely has. <laughs> I'll say. My gut says that once the truth comes out, there's gonna be a whole lot of it coming out at once. But before all that, we've got to figure out what other worlds are connected to this one. And the reason everybody else is fighting. It's all fine if they're right to go home. I want to go home. I'll go start sniffing around for that stuff. You go and gather more info on the Keystone. Are you sure we should split up? He doesn't want to be seen dead with you, kid. That's not what I expected to hear. Did you forget that we were enemies back in our world or something? Besides, I don't get a lot of chances to fight people like these in broad daylight. I'm not a one tag partner kind of guy either. Got a lot of people I want to join up with. Oh, he likes to spread the love elsewhere. I'm just not a one girl kind of guy. Somehow, that doesn't surprise me. I got, I got a lot of cameras. Sorry, I got a lot of notes to spread everywhere. I'm finishing up now. I've got guts. Anyway, don't get that stone taken away before you face off with me now. <laughs> sure. If you can last that long. Damn, that be fine and talk. Damn. Didn't expect that I'd run into anyone from Amnesia here. Or that I'd fight alongside them, for that matter. How much more gas does this world have left in the tank? Uh, chapter four, so we still got a bit left to go. Uh, but I guess that's just the way things are. If anyone else from the Hollow Knight was here, I'd team up with them too. Well, you may have just triggered something. Yeah. Oh no, it's Whis! Not broken yet, huh? Good. That makes this so much more fun. And it's Azrael! Oh, I'm so happy for you. But I take no joy in this. Oh, jeez. Oh, man, this is out of control! Hold on, meathead. Let me in on the fun. Not a chance. How could I resist burying my fangs in a field so full of prey? I need to satisfy my hunger. This asshole's seriously pissing me off. All that muscle's made its way to his brain. I still think that's a girl, though. Every time I see that guy, I just keep thinking he's a bit too feminine. What is it with Japanese animation and certain ones that make it look proper sus? Like if one of them's a guy or a girl. <laughs> I hate it when I'm right. Huh? You? Who are you again? Wait, that weird color scheme. Clownfish? Oh, shut up. I don't expect you to remember anything anyway. What the hell are you doing here? Show up, really. I have. Wow, up here. That's nice. Ah, don't just shout at me like that. <laughs> yeah. Huh? What the hell? Some half-naked man is attacking a girl in a dress. Very observant, that hide. Fucking. Uh on. Hold on. How does that make sense? I thought you couldn't fight in this world outside of a two-on-two -two tag battle. That's, that's right, but, uh, but just look at that macho man. He's going berserk. I can't hold him back. How does that work? That's what I want to know. Because to be honest, I'm basically like a god here. I can create rules as I see fit. The law bends to my will. I literally have divine powers. So divine! And yet they still have no effect on that man. Oh, this is trouble. I think in, in Asriel meant to be like a god anyway or something. I'm not sure. Hey! 
Are you okay? Yes. It's nice to see a sane-looking face for a change. So, why is he attacking you? Who is he? I wish I knew. Oh, seems like you have an interesting texture. Good. More to sink my teeth into. Hey, you need you really do need to get you some freaking Burger King or a Big Mac or something, mate, right? just to hit quench your edge. Stand back, meathead. That's my prey. Seriously? Now's not the time to I know you had the keystone, asshole. Hand it over! I don't get it. We're from the same world, and I'm getting us all back. Why do you want it? I thought the rules said we had to take the keystones from people from other worlds in order to go home. That's a very smart question there, Ashel. Huh? Who gives a shit about the rules? I do what I want. Besides, think about what you're taking us back to. This place is full of people with powers. I don't have a single goddamn reason to go back to the boring world we came from. But I'm sure a little bitch like you must miss your mommy. <laughs> what? Uh, uh, excuse me. Uh, what, what did you just say? So all you How want dare to do you? is get in fights with tough opponents. Yeah, that sounds like you. I don't want to go back to our boring everyday life. Only weaklings want that kind of shit. And that's just what you are, a weakling. I feel offended. I want to see the look on your face as all your pride is stripped away. The fear in your eyes as you struggle with all your might to stay alive. His arms look like he's been freaking shoulder deep into some fucking... Nah, we just can't describe what where his hands have been. The moment you realize you're too weak to protect the ones you care about and start to break down in tears. And then, as I stare into your eyes, I want you to fully understand that there is no one better than me. Okay. <sighs> that idea simply disgusts me. Oh? There's no shame in yearning for battle. It allows you to test both your own and your opponent's limits. However, someone who wants to devour everything around them is no better than an animal. <laughs> you make me laugh, girl. An animal. That's just fine with me. You animal. I eat when I want to eat and attack when I want to attack. Trying to fight your primal urges is nonsense. <laughs> I guess we're getting nowhere with this. Now, come at me. I'll take all three of you at once. You're just really overdoing it, dude. <laughs> hey, what do we do here? You're the moderator, aren't you? Hurry up and moderate. Oh, okay. Since you gave me the go-ahead, let's make this into a proper battle. Team Hyde and Weiss versus Team Asriel and Carmine. Let's fight! Let's fight! Oh, you're making me team up with this meathead? Well, you can't fight if you're not part of a tag team, right? Uh. I'm sorry to have pulled you into this. Oh, you so nice, Waze. No worries. They'd have come after my keystone at some point anyway. May I call you Hyde? Yeah. Your name's Weiss, right? I don't plan on fighting them until they're both down. I'll give us a chance to escape, so just hang in there until then. Okay, let's go. Get ready. Get ready! Get ready! To fight! Let's go! Can't escape from crossing fate! Fight! Ah, I see you! Okay. Good. 
Come on, give me a challenge! Nope, I blocked it. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, alright. Alright, fucking hell. Oh, I'll run it down me before I'm okay. Oh, get him out of the way. No longer the censure about this character. I can't believe I lost the character though, that's fucking bad. Twice. There's no point in fighting them any longer. We need to run. Run, bitch, run! Let's go! D wait, Cloudfish! Why are you calling me that? I was about to fuck off. Whew. I don't think they're following us anymore. We should be safe. But that lobster and that half-naked dude, they're not right. I hope that's the last we see of them. He <laughs> just called Carmine a lobster while. Oh, right. Weiss, are you okay? You're not injured, are you? Nothing major, just a few bumps and scratches. By the way, you make for a very passable partner. Not bad, given that it was our first time fighting together. Is that you being nice to me? Wow. Passable? Could you have given me a snootier compliment? Well, whatever. If you're healthy enough to look down your nose at me, you're healthy enough to keep moving. <laughs> Seriously, thank you for helping me. It was no problem. Like I said earlier, I'd probably be fighting those guys down the road anyway. Sadly, I'm afraid our collaboration ends here. We each have our own objectives to fulfill. But, but what if I wanted to stay with you never leave Friend. the place? And fighting those two wasn't exactly quick. I better get going. Well then, I bid you farewell. I bid you adieu. Heart. Yeah, safe travels. Off she goes. Oh, uh, crap. I probably should have asked her about the keystone. Probably hide. Damn it. I really screwed up. Seems like you do that a lot. Wow, stop watching over me, voice from above. Nobody asked you. I like having Morgan Freeman stood up or watching over you saying, saying shit about your life all the time. Man, I'm getting kind of hungry. I wonder what I know he's about. I thought that was me then. Yes, it makes sense though. I've pretty much been fighting non stop since I got here. I should find a place to rest. I want to hurry, but I can't keep pushing myself like this. Um, excuse me? Oh, hi, Yukiko. Yeah. <laughs> I want to react. Yeah. You're a student, right? Please, I need your help. Hey, hey, calm down. I'm Hyde Keto. Mind if I ask your name? Oh, sorry. I'm Yukiko Amagi. Yukiko, huh? I take it you came from another world, too? Something like that. I was with a friend earlier, but we got split up. But that's not the problem right now! Th the curry! Wait, what? The curry? Huh? Curry? By curry, do you mean curry curry? Like, the food? What's curry even doing in a world like this? Why well, ask questions? If it's curry, eat it. Yukiko! Oh god, now we're there again. Oh no! We got called pedophiles in the last one by here. I don't know why. Where did you go? I'm not gonna let you escape on your own. 
Platinum Chun? Hey, can't you see you're upsetting her? What do you want with her anyway? Huh? The hell are you? Some punk outsider getting in my face and acting all high and mighty all of a sudden? Just back off. I was about no. Or do you want to eat the curry too? Oh, if you're cooking curry though. Again with the curry? What's the big deal about this curry? Oh, wait, both of you, please wait. Uh, Luna, she's already here. Uh, you're right, Senna. Huh? Who are you talking to? There you have it. There's nowhere to run, Yukiko. No! Hey, uh, Yukiko? What's going on here? Why are you so scared? Yeah, why, why are these people scared of curry? Is it like really, really hot curry? Damn! <sighs> I finally caught up to you. What's the matter, you two? You ran off right as we were sitting down to eat. How many of you girls are there? I'm just asking for a friend, obviously. Uh huh? Um, who are you? Oh, me? I'm Hyde. Hyde Keto, but... Nice to meet you, Hyde. I'm Lieutenant Noel Vermilion. Well, I guess I'm not a lieutenant anymore. By the way, Hyde, would you like to have dinner with us? Who could refuse a cute face like that? Dinner? I mean, I guess that explains the curry, but... This seems kind of out of the blue. The three of us made it together. We found the ingredients and cooking utensils just lying around. That's right. But we made a little too much. Well, might as well not look a gift horse in the mouth. I am pretty hungry, so I might as well. I still don't get that say well I get it, but I don't I don't get it if you get what I mean. Looking a gift horse in the mouth. I can just imagine somebody look like literally got his head inside a horse's mouth. I know it's not meant like that, but you know what I mean. It's really weird. Keto -kun, don't Great! I'll go ahead and make you a plate. Yeah. This can't be good. Alright, help yourself. What is that? Have they had to pixel out because it's something out of a freaking hentai or something? Or is that actually how it is? That is that's not curry. That's um Hmm. That's weird that. Is this curry? Hmm? Yeah, just regular curry. Why does it look metallic? Oh, well, that's interesting. Maybe it's because we used ingredients from this world. But don't worry about the flavor. It's real curry through and through. I guarantee it. Have you tried it, though? Hell no, it's not. This is definitely not curry. There's no way. No way. I would eat that if you paid me. The pressure coursing out of this dish. It's as if the Hollow Knight was simmered in a pot and served up on a plate. Screw the flavor guarantee. I just want to know if I'll survive. I, is it my fault? Yukiko? Once I split up with my friend, I wandered around lost before stumbling onto these two. They said they were making curry, so I thought I'd help. Oh, so you randomly come across two strangers that are making curry, and you thought, oh, I don't mind. Let, let me just throw some elves in there. I just never thought it would turn out like that. It, don't blame yourself. All you did was help them, right? I can't imagine you did anything that would cause this to happen. I thought things looked a, a little odd while we were cooking, but by the time I realized it, it was already too late. A little? By then the curry was done! And Platinum Chan! Say no more. I can imagine what happened next. But this is just an accident. 
a natural disaster, not anyone's fault. Yeah, I could say that. It happens. You can say that. Um, what have you guys been talking about? Her obliviousness is truly evil. You, Noel, right? I'm sorry, but I'm afraid I'm gonna have to pass on the curry. Huh? But why? There's no way I would eat that. I mean, there's no way I would let poor Yukiko eat that. But, but, then, do you want it platinum? Huh? Oh, um, the Luna's already full. S Sana, you're hungry, right? Luna, why do you always make me eat the weird stuff? I don't want my mouth to explode again. What weird stuff have you been eating? Explode? Please tell me that's just a figure of speech. Hey, Yukiko! I told you I'm not gonna let you escape after what I had to go through! You two, Blondie! Take the damn plate! I said that's not gonna happen! Why are we fighting on the corner, though? Damn it! How do I get out of this? You could always settle things with a tag battle. Yeah, you're right. If we had a tag battle, we'd... Wait, not you again! God, you always show up out of nowhere. Hey, don't give me that attitude! I'm just trying to help. Yes, Miss Robotic Voice, you're always trying to help. Of course you are. Anyway, when you said settle things, what do you mean? Isn't it obvious? You guys do a tag battle match, and the loser eats the curry. Simple. What? Uh, why does anyone have to eat the... It's settled! We're doing this right here, right now! The loser eats the curry and that's final! Oh well, get prepared to eat the curry, you big zipper ditch! Hey, hey, wait! Don't be so hasty! No objections that I can hear! And anyone who complains has to eat a big spoonful of that curry as a penalty. Oh, that's a hell of a way to keep us quiet. This is turning into a battle that I can't afford to lose. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to involve you like this. <laughs> Don't sweat it, Yukiko. There's no way I'd let you eat that curry. Oh, he's, he's getting in there. He's like, he's sliding into the DMs like, no worries. Enough with the talking. Let's see you young guns fire at each other. Proper flirt to me, you, you with the you keep I can't in English. I'm in English. I would never let a lady eat that curry. Get ready. Get ready. Okay. Let's fly through this next fight. Go from there. Can't escape from crossing fate. Fight! Wow. What was that? Hello? You need to turn my ass up. Turn down for what? <laughs> Oh, okay, okay. I didn't have to bring my own ass in. Yukiko carried like a mouse. And done. Team Hyde and Yukiko win. GG. Sheesh. I figured I'd have to fight over the keystone, but curry? I'm a million years. Damn it. We lost. Um, does that mean... The losing team, Platinum and Noel, must eat all of the remaining curry. On the base getting nice. Oh, there's so much left. I don't know if we can eat it all. Just don't shred your fingers up like last time. 
But we did just exercise. I think that if we try hard enough, we can do it. Right, Platinum? Uh, I... I... Huh? Platinum, what's wrong? I can't take that curry anymore! Platinum? Where are you going? Wait! Wait, stop! D hey, come back! I still have some questions! A little late on that one, buddy. Um... Are you hungry, Keto-kun? I think I could use the leftover ingredients to make curry. <laughs> no. <laughs> Sorry, but no. I don't even want to look at curry after all this. So, Yukiko, you came from the same world as the people I met earlier. Hanamura and Chie, right? Yeah, sounds like you ran straight into my friends. Well, Ruby did. Hmm. Must have been fate. Well, that or the fact that this world is really tiny. Speaking of which, I'm sure you'll see them again in no time. Amagi! Narukami-kun! Narukami-kun! <laughs> What'd I just say? This world might actually be a little too small. I'm so glad you're here, Narukami-kun! You're not hurt or anything, are you? I'm fine. Looks like you're alright, too. Hey, I... I hate to break up the dramatic reunion, but we're kind of under a deadline here. Who's this? A new boyfriend, who do you think? Oh, right! This is Hyde Kido. He just saved me. Oh, I was in the neighborhood. Is that right? Thank you for looking out for my friend. Don't mention it. By the way, Narukami, there's something I want to ask you. About this stone, right? <laughs> You're pretty smart. I'm guessing you came from another world, too. Yep, even got a stone of my own. That's why I wanted to talk about using these to get home. Well, that's convenient. Oh no. Kiyokun! <sighs> Missed me by an inch. Dodged my slash, did you? You're not half bad. Oh, thank you. Now, which one are you? Who are you? You won't live long enough to know. It's Jin! Damn it. This guy really wants to kill me. Oh, this is bad. Really bad. Really, really bad. Hold it, Jin. Oh, it's the talking cat. That's... A cat? It's the talking cat. You damn fool. What are you doing running off on your own like that? What I do is my business. It doesn't concern you. Like hell, it doesn't. If you run off trying to chop off everyone's heads, nobody's gonna sit and talk to us. If we can work things out, then... Pointless. If they have a stone, I'll take it. That's all there is to it. And I'm telling you to stop! Are they... infighting? And I gotta admit, the talking, clothes-wearing cat kinda makes it hard to take the earlier death threat quite so seriously. Well, yeah, because it's a talking cat, dude. It? It's kind of cute. Don't be happy. Hey, sorry this idiot caused you so much trouble. The name's Jubei. Like you, I'm here from another world. A world of walking, talking, clothed cats, huh? Honestly, I'd kind of rather go there than back home. Mind if we shoot the breeze a little? I want to talk about that stone you've got. You mean the keystone? That's the one. If you don't mind, I'd like to hear about everything that's happened to you since you got here. And I'll tell you all about me, too. Let's put all our information together and understand what's going down. I don't mind listening. 
Work for you, Hyde? Yeah, of course. I've been wanting a peaceful conversation ever since I got here. Who knew that a cat would be the one to give it to me? Much obliged. Right then. How about you fight us? But uh, hang on. What? You wanted a conversation, and now you want to fight? Huh? Wait. What the hell? That's not a peaceful conversation at all. Where'd this come from? Silence. Shut up and fight, or else you die. Wait, did you lie to us? Sorry. Right now we gotta do this. But don't worry, I promise I'll share some info when this is over. Yippee! This is going shockingly smoothly. I wish it was this easy every time. Looks like we're doing this. I hardly have the will to object anymore. You in, Narukami? I'm gonna say I'm, I'm put with you, ain't I? I don't sense any evil intent from that cat. We just have to trust him. Stand back, Amagi. Okay. Narukami-kun, Kido-kun, please be careful. Be you anything, my dear? Be you anything? Hide. These two. Yeah, they seem pretty strong. I hate to say it, but a fair fight might not cut it. We just need to work together. I can't guarantee how long we'll last, though. Fine by me. We've only just met, but I already have absolute confidence in you. Oh, have you? What a coincidence. The feeling's mutual. Is it really? <laughs> Okay, let's go. Get ready. Get ready. We're fighting against a stuck up boy and a fighting cat. Let's go. Can't escape from crossing fate. Fight! I will go back. Up and at him. Leave it to me. Go! Come on! Stay down. Stay down. Rock fire! Slice! Go, you ready? Freeze! Freeze! Don't move! Oh, Ooh, combo! Did you say Black Panther? Stay down, Jesus. I got freaking served. All the coons. They really are tough. Don't give up. They've got to have some weakness. Yes, 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 yes. What an electrifying match. The new world is just around the corner. One more push, everyone. You can do it. You can do it. That's about what I thought. Lower your sword, Jin. Hey! One minute you suddenly attack us, and the next you forfeit the match? What gives? I told you I'd talk, so let's talk. We'll start with that keystone of yours. Or maybe I should call it the core of this world. The core? This keystone? And that's why you had us fight just now? So I can take all the kills. Sharp one, ain't ya? That's right. There was a reason y'all needed to hold on to that stone as you fought. What would that be? What's the story, Jin? It's just as we thought. I can sense the evil power flowing into that stone. 
The power of order tells me so. Hmm. So fight must activate it. Hold the phone. What are you guys blabbering about? You're in the middle of a fight. Don't just stand there. Shut up, woman. We're talking here. Why not? Are we inconveniencing you? <laughs> I haven't the foggiest idea what you're talking about. Huh. Play dumb if you like. I'll just destroy the stone. Hey, hey slow down there, Jin. Hold on. Let me just catch up, okay? Don't we need the stone to get back to our original world? I should be the plan. How would you destroy it? That is correct. It must be protected at all costs. <laughs> Who's that? It's us. You. Capturing highest priority target. Strategic action initiated. What? Whoa! Oh no! I've been pinched! Okay, we're getting close to the end now. Oops! Damn it, what now? Hey, Narukami, are you okay? Wait. Where are they? Can anyone hear me? Hello? No way. Did... Did everyone disappear? Pretty much. No. You have been transported, Haidkido. You're that girl. What did you do? I transferred you. You... transferred me? You mean, like, teleportation? Man, it's like you're straight out of a manga. Can you warp too? Ain't that funny? It's this straight out of manga. It appears you understand sufficiently. Like hell I do. This is insane. Stop being so casual about it. It was a necessary measure to protect the keystone you hold. What's more? I refuse to let any more battle data be squandered through careless collection procedures. And you lost me again. What's this about battle data? It does not concern you. Now, please hand over the keystone. No, I don't want to. You can't have it. There it is. After all this fuss, you're just after the keystone too, huh? Unfortunately for you, that's not going to happen. I'm not giving this up. Very well. Then I shall take it by force. What? Is that me? Okay, I guess I know what she meant by battle data now. Data loaded. Systems. All green. Where's my partner? Please surrender. The delta in our power should be evident. <sighs> You're right. I should minimize it. Oh, it's a girl from earlier. You. Y y you. Lene. Glad to see you in one piece, Hyde. Of course. Dying's not an option. Kept the keystone safe too. See. Nice work. We had quite the turnout on our end too. Did you figure something out? Yeah. Apparently this world, this phantom field, is a more localized phenomenon than we thought. Phantom field? This place is, as the name suggests, a world constructed of thought. The transient materialization of a dream. And the element that allowed it to catalyze is that keystone you hold. It seems that stone will allow us to return to our original world, but... But... What? Look, I'm barely following this anyway, so just say what you're gonna say. Well, it seems if we use that keystone to return to our world, we'll bring aspects of this one back with us. Really? I'm kind of getting confused myself. I just don't know why that happens or what elements will carry over. 
But there's definitely some sort of intent behind it. That much is clear. I see. That's a lot to take in. So, what happens if these elements do come home with us? I don't know. But maybe someone here does. Right, girl? Rabbit? It looks like this fight is inevitable. No, it isn't Rabbit, then it's Esther. <laughs> but the rabbit will pop her out of the corner. More organic than I thought. She's coming, Hyde. Can you still fight? Oh, I can. If you're going to slow me down, you can just lie there. Wow, she's fucking bitchy. Oh, I'm ready. Just try and keep up, Lene. I think this one's like a lot shorter than that. Um, than the first two episodes of this story. Okay, let's do this. Oh, finally she fights! Leave it to me. Down. One, two, three. Up we go. Counter. Counter. Split the sky. Lene. Slide. One. Good grade. You die. Let's go. Counter. Oh shit. You're pretty good. No way. Easy. Easy. All right, all right, that's enough. Playtime is over. <coughs> Excuse me. That voice. You again? What do you want now? The accumulation rate is. Hmm. Oh, it's definitely getting there. Yeah, I think we're good. No, hide keto. Okay then. Hey, it seems like going. it's time to proceed to the final phase. Oh no, it's final round. Final round to help. And we're here. This is the last stage. The moment of truth. The moment of truth. Damn it! Teleported again. What the hell is this place? It's pitch black. Stop screaming. I'd say the dark rather suits yeah, people. Yeah, like not us. so bad. Not so bad. Lene, you're here too. I'm right next to you. <sighs> so it's all come down to this. But one shabby painter alone can't create a beautiful work of art. Or is this what you wanted? Tell me, artist, is this the finished piece you had in mind? Because it looks to me like you lack imagination. Well, moderator? Uh, someone's a poke. Aw, oh, jeez. Guess you figured it all out, huh? Pretty much. I haven't. What are you talking about? This world, the thoughts at the core of this phantom field, all belong to this voice. Am I wrong? Huh? Are you serious? That's right! You have finally arrived at the truth! ling a ling a ling, -ling. No way. Then you weren't joking when you called yourself a god. So it seems. Well, now that you have us in the dark, what does a god like you intend to do with us? That sounds so dirty. I'm being theatrical. Theatrical! Theatrical! Theatrical? Then you're telling me we're not done? Of course not. I'm just setting the stage for the climax. You gotta have the lighting just right to reveal hey, the villain, right? Like so. Uh, hide the keystone. What? Hey all. Whoa! Whoa, baby. Is that thing 
Did my keystone turn into that? I see. So that's your true form. Yes. Thanks to all of you, I've accumulated enough power to take shape. Thanks to all of us? Wait. You're talking about battle data, aren't you? You tricked us! Yes. Thank you for following my instructions and collecting all that information. You can take your thanks and shove them up your... Oh, come on, you're gonna say it. You... Oh, I wasn't gonna say shove up your ass. Then the battles over the Keystone merely laid the groundwork. That is correct. In order to provide myself with a self-sustaining form, I needed large amounts of both energy and information. Both of which would be an endless supply if I pitted subjects from different worlds against each other. Utini! Were you lying when you said we could return to our original world, too? That was not a lie. With the power of the stone, we can very easily get to your world. In fact, I am attempting to go there at this very moment. What? Take pride in knowing that your world is the first I shall honor with my presence. Um, I was gonna stream today, but can't, couldn't be asked. <laughs> that's fair enough. So that's your plan. Hide, we need to stop her before it's too late. You just got some new LED panels, nice. Yeah, that much I get. But what does she actually plan to do? She's going to consume Kanzakai. What? And not just Kanzakai, the entire world around it. In time, the Phantom Field is going to devour all of our worlds. You've got to be kidding. That would be chaos! But why do you want to combine all of our worlds? No reason in particular. The convergence of worlds is merely my function, not any sort of desire. I was just following my programming. Uh, everyone's trophies are actually look to be fair. Are you kidding me? I'll do it in a minute. We're not gonna let you screw with our worlds for some dumb reason like that. I couldn't agree more. Sorry, but we're ending this. You created this world and dragged everyone in here for your stupid scheme. You forced people into battles they didn't want to fight. Some people have even been hurt. I'm sure it must have felt great to watch us all dance to your twisted tune. Uh, yours is still showing us 12 minutes Oh, okay. I don't know that. But that all ends right now. I'll finish this with my own two hands. Final battle time! Get ready! Get ready! Okay, so basically get as close to her as I can. Spam attack her because she has ranged attacks. Go from there. Can't escape from crossing fate! Fight! Fire! Attack! Hey. Can't die! I got this! Brave! Don't you go! Can't Oh my god, she's actually. Oh crap. There we go. Twist through that. Nice. Now hide. Finish it. How? How could I have been defeated? Uh, I've got two plots I can get this month. Is that not including the ones you've already got, like with the Star Wars one the other day, or is that two that you're close to getting? It's not that complicated. You tried to 
cheat the world without knowing who is in it. That's all there is to it. Oh, too close again. Cool, cool. It's over. Sleep for eternity. Are you nearly at Platinum for God here? Jesus. I'm Neo, fuck no. Nice job, Hyde. Impressive work. For you. Hey, I'm saving the world here. You don't have to be so stingy with the praise. So, what now? Do we get to go back to Kanzakai? I don't know. For now, we should investigate the Keystone's remains and gather some info. Now you've done it! Oh no. Whoa, she can still move? Damn, she's awfully persistent. Is she? Not done struggling yet, huh? What the hell is going on? What the hell's going on here? Now that the Keystone has been destroyed, control of this world is out of my hands. Gee, I hope things all work out. Are you kidding me? At this point, what could you possibly have up your sleeve? Oh, look! It's beginning. Not this again! Whoa! What is this? Huh? This... This is Kanzakai. Did we make it back? Oh god, we're back home, yay! Oh, so now you wake up. Lene, you're here! Hey, this is Kanzakai, right? This isn't a dream, is it? Yeah, at least from the looks of things. Huh? What do you mean? <laughs> you have the naked patch for this game? No. No, I don't think this would even come with a naked patch, dude. Maybe for something like this in Rankigora. I think there is a naked patch, or I know on the PC version you can get like a, a big boob mod where it just gets stupidly stupidly huge. What the hell was that? Damn it, Waldstein. At your age for once. Old man Wald? And there's that crazy half naked dude. What the hell is going on? Why are they fighting in Kanzakai? Don't need a naked patch for Outlast, that's true. Oh, Hyde! Hey, uh... I've got Ruby's here as well. Hyde, you're safe. Ruby? Narukami? You too? Okay, hold on. I have no idea what's going on. What exactly is happening here? Well... It's the Kanzakai Scramble! A sizzling brawl tag battle tournament! Oh no. What she said. <laughs> okay, that is not an answer. Now I'm even more confused. Explain this to me. Oh, why are you so dense? I didn't think the name was that confusing. We're basically having a blazing hot battle right here in Kanzakai. <sighs> Nobody asked you. It is what it is, Hyde. We screwed things up. Oh no. Huh? What do you mean, screwed things up? We destroyed the Keystone, which was the core of the Phantom Field. When the world lost its backbone and collapsed, everyone should have been released to their respective worlds. But then, BOOM! At the very end, you saved me! Well, we saved her? When did that happen? The last battle. As we fought her, she collected energy and information from us. And using Kanzakai as her base, she created a new phantom field. Oh no. Hey, Lene, do you really understand everything that's going on right now? Because I don't. D don't be rude. Yes, it's all hearsay but I'm trying to explain everything to you to the best of my ability. Anyway, this is a reconstruction of Kanzakai. And you know what that means, don't you? 
of reconstruction? Then... Let me take the words right out of your mouth. This place is both Kanzakai and not Kanzakai. Wow. How philosophical. Wow, so philosophical. Basically, we're starting from square one. We have to redo this whole damn fiasco from the very beginning. Oh no! Are you kidding me? I wish. Looks like we've got a work cut out for us. I'm just excited that I get to see so many cool weapons! Ruby, you're just... crazy. Buff up! There's no time to be depressed. You've got an opponent to fight. Huh? Opponent? We're still fighting? <laughs> so you're my next match, huh? You're just a kid. It's Ragnar! And I'm just gonna kick your ass. <laughs> Fine. I'm in. I was hoping to take you on eventually. There you go. That's the way to make a first impression. I swear, you're still so green. What's this? Our contestants are entering the battlefield one after the other. All right. I've got no idea where we are, but it sounds like I've just got to kick everyone's asses. Not a bad roar for such a young pup. Now, come and be devoured. Be devoured, lol. Allow me to aid you all in battle. Now, who is to be my first opponent? Is her entire body a weapon? Oh, me! Me, 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 me! Pick me! I'll be your opponent! <laughs> All the guns! Pick me! This is looking more like a battle royale than a tag battle, but I will allow it! Let's get this all wrapped up! Ready? Fight! Damn. This world is even more screwed up than the last one. I'm tired of this nonsense. Sorry, but I'm taking you down quick. Took the words right out of my mouth. You're done for. Jeez. This is gonna be a long night. Bring it on! I'm gonna take back our world. <laughs> <laughs> 